Hello, everybody. I hope you're having a real spooky night in March. In today's episode of Movie Night, we're going to be talking about Tower of Terror. A lot of you have probably already heard of this movie, but if you have not, Tower of Terror from 1997 is a made-for-TV movie from 1997. It was made for the wonderful world of Disney. I had a hard time saying that. That's really cool. So one interesting thing about this film was it was actually filmed at the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror ride at Disney World. So it was filmed in Orlando at the ride, which is pretty cool. Uh, you know, more information, please. Yeah. I think it's mainly the exterior shots. It was also filmed on a sound stage, but I think they successfully blend them together pretty well. I like that. But before we watch this movie, I'm not dressed to talk about a scary movie. So, I'll be right back. Do not go anywhere. Oh. Help me! Don't let the monster eat me! Oh. Hope I didn't scare you too bad. So, with my Grim Reaper robe on, Let's watch it. It started on Halloween. I used to be terrified of this as a child. I was a baby. There is a lot of lightning in this movie, and it, it, it's okay. I'm here, you don't have to be scared. So another thing I kind of noticed with this movie, I just got really close to the mic, sorry. There are a lot of interesting transitions, uh, especially this first one you see, where there's a shot of an elevator and you go through it. It's hard to describe, it looks weird. Uh, but I like it. What? So this opening shot is actually pretty impressive. Uh, there's a lot of extras, and uh, there's a lot of dancing. A lot of complicated camera things going on here that yeah, I think is impressive, especially for a TV movie from 1997. I want to take a moment here and appreciate the design of the Hollywood Tower Hotel as a ride. Uh, it's just amazing. Obviously, I don't have to tell anyone that the detail that goes into rides at Disney, it's another level, uh, really. And honestly, the perfect place to shoot a movie. So they had the right idea. <clears throat> Plants. I do think this scene has a really nice build up to them getting struck by lightning and then died. And this is something I didn't really notice as a kid was how many transitions they have that are just really unique and just cool ideas. Some of them don't work as well, like the beginning elevator one. It's just weird. I don't know if I like it, but then I do like it. It's just strange. This scene used to terrify me as a child. I. Didn't know why, just the weird cut to it, and just the alien on the table. Don't even think about it. I also don't really understand why she has to be in the costume for a photo shoot. You just have the costume on the table. 
and not risk having your niece's head cut off in the process. Don't even think about that. Uh, how'd I do? Uh, did you believe I was like a, a real doctor? Oh, absolutely, because I hate doctors, and right now, I hate you. Incredible. Really? Yeah. Thanks. Oh, great. I'll Listen, I'm also bail the process. Of course you are. You're fantastic. Do you do commercials? Oh, I do all the time. Do not grow up to be an actor. Yeah, actors are kind of crazy. I had uh, one actor friend who uh, tried to cut my head off. Let's go, Bail. Let me help you. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh, thank you. Uh, thank you, buddy. Oh. Oh. What have you got in here? Prunes. I don't want to ask. How's your mother doing? My mother? My mother died about 10 years ago, Mr. Galvale. Oh. I think I just let a ghost in your apartment. Tower of Terror has some pretty solid performances all around, with the creepy old lady probably being the best. And you'll see why at the end. It gets depressing. Yeah, it's the Hollywood Tower Hotel. Halloween night, 1939. Five people disappeared mysteriously from the elevator, including Sally Shine, child movie star. Made little Sally a legend. Tell me something I don't know. All right. I'll tell you what really happened that night. Oh, yeah, lady? And how's that? Oh, because, young man, I was there. So. I like the actors in this. Call me Q. I can quartermaster. If you need it, I can get it for you. Huh. Well, thanks for meeting me here, Q. <sighs> no problem, man. This is my busy season. Around Halloween, everybody wants to know about Sally Shine. You know, it helps the cash flow. Yeah, I love these scenes where he's uh, just kind of walking around, looking at stuff. It's pretty fun. I enjoy myself. This scene also terrified me. But it is also very cool. Very, Very cool, cool mirror. mirror. Oh, come on, dude, give me a break. You said you were gonna help them, but you lied. I guess the truth is, does it matter to you? <laughs> my birth, my birth. It was a surprise. Whoa, the, the party was for Abigail. I, I, I didn't know, I, I didn't know. You loved Abigail, didn't you? She was my best friend. Abby didn't care that I was a star. Don't say that. I yeah, as soon as Sally gets down to the basement and sees Abigail, it, it just gets depressing. It just makes me very, very sad. Hey, Mr. Todd, how about a picture on your big Okay, everybody, we're gonna go see, right? My boy Q looks fine in a suit. Well, 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 that's the end of the movie. Tower of Terror will always have a special place in my heart. Even if I don't think it's perfect, still a very fun movie to watch. And Disney, put this on Disney Plus now. Thank you everybody for watching along with me. I'll see you next time on Movie, movie Night. Night.